The controversy over Sanjay Leela Bhansali's film Padmavati has become extremely excessive, enormously exaggerated and hopelessly disproportionate. After fringe political groups and national parties, even ex-royals from Jaipur and Mewar, what's an ex-royal anyway, have woken up to ask for the ban of this film. Joining us is an alleged erstwhile royal who allegedly claims to be a direct descendant of Rani Padmavati herself. Ex-Maharani Princess Padma Sen Kumari is here. Welcome to the show, ex-Maharani Princess Padma Sen Kumari. <laughs> now about this whole controversy uh, about Sanjay Leela Bansali's film Padmavati, uh, please. Yes, you see, we have to protect our culture and heritage. We cannot just let anyone and anybody come and distort the facts and insult the history of our ancestors. So clearly then, you are objecting to the film. I'd love to, but I'm far too busy supervising the renovation of the palace. What? what, what hello? Namaste and welcome to our city palace. The room I am sitting in has just been restored to its original glory. But hey, hang on, just a minute, just a minute. The room was built in 1567 and it used to be called the Rang Mahal. It was rather large, so we split it into three rooms and now we call it the Sanjay Leela Bansali room. <laughs> The Sanjay room, the Leela room, the ones. What, I, I thought you were uh, against. And we've also just finished renovating the big banquet hall with the Italian crystal chandeliers. What banquet hall? The one with the 300 seated table. It is called the Deepika Mahal. Did you say Deepika Mahal? Yes, because a lot of people can feast on her. I mean, on, on the large table. Oh, I know, I know. And the big room with the vintage Lalik table in the center and the jade statues, the big ballroom, it will be called the Shahid Haveli. Shahid as in the actor Kapoor? Well, yes. And the open veranda with the Portuguese tiles and the fountains from Florence, it's a bit loud and ostentatious. It will be called Ranveer Bar. Ranveer Bar, but, but, but you just... And the whole palace will be converted into a seven-star luxury hotel and we will call it Padmavati Villas. Well, hang on a minute, I thought you were objecting to the film. I never said that. But you said you cannot allow anyone to insult the history of your ancestors, that you have to protect your culture, to protect your heritage. And that is exactly what I am doing. No, how are you protecting your culture and heritage by selling out? You've dedicated your whole palace to Sanjay Leela Bansali and his film. Of course I have. So how does that protect your culture? Where do you think all the money needed to protect our heritage and culture comes from? The Karnisenas, the Mahasabhas, or the BJP, or the retired royals? Uh, yeah, no, I mean, no. It comes from the fees paid for film locations and rooms per night. It comes from you and Sanjay Leela Bansali. Doli tala dola baje. I see. On that note, so how much will Sanjay Leela Bansali charge to dance at my uh, son's wedding? <laughs> But I don't, I don't think Shahrukh I can afford. I was thinking of something in between. What? Okay, not Sanjay Jilab and Bansali, just Sanjay.